These microscopic worms have male and female bodies, but researchers at the University of Utah can make them behave like the opposite sex by activating a gene in their brains. A female avoids other females, uh, and males uh, are attracted to females. And so what we can do is swap those behaviors. Eric Jorgensen and Jamie White changed the behavior of these nematodes in order to better understand their brains. The nerve cell in a worm is exactly how a nerve cell in the human brain works. So if we can understand it in a worm, we'll be able to understand how the brain works in the human, and that is our goal. As they wrote in the journal Current Biology, the study showed that in worms, sexuality is hardwired in the brain and is not affected by the body or hormones. So that means that we can now study the brain and the brain alone and understand how this behavior arises. Jorgensen says that's not true in people, where hormones as well as thinking and consciousness play a role. But to ever understand human brains and behaviors, the researchers say the place to start is the wiring of a brain circuit in a tiny worm. I'm Sunita Reed.